At 250 feet across and more than 50 years old, the Lovell Telescope still gathers radio signals from the farthest corners of the universe today. A groundbreaking piece of technology dreamt up by Sir Bernard Lovell. It was an engineering marvel, the largest steerable radio telescope in the world. And he was recognised for his achievements. It was decided that the local school at Oldland Common here in South Gloucestershire, the place where he was born, would be renamed after him. And so, in May 1972, Sir Bernard arrived to officially open Sir Bernard Lovell School. And Points West cameras were here. The head teacher said today Sir Bernard was always in touch and allowed the school to use the Jodrell Bank logo on its signs. A proud connection to such an inspiring astronomer and scientist. As a teenager himself, he studied physics at Bristol University. He was still interested in astronomy after he'd retired, though he was also interested in uh, music and cricket. I think he would have been delighted uh, to know that the school that's named after him outside Bristol had Marcus Triscothic as one of its old boys. He had a strict religious upbringing here and even had a spell as the organist at Bath Abbey. And Sir Bernard was once named as one of the greatest astronomers of all time, close behind Galileo and Isaac Newton. In other words, we believe this quasar is at a distance of at least 8,000 million light years. He would have turned 99 at the end of this month.